Hi there. Today, I'm going to explain to you about an exceptional Indian movie that was released in 2022. Before we proceed, please consider subscribing. Also, don't forget to like and share this video so that other people enjoy it as well. So, let's get straight into the movie. The movie is called KGF Chapter 2. It is a sequel to KGF Chapter 1. The story begins like this. Anand Ingalagi has a stroke after he finishes describing the events that took place in KGF Chapter 1. His son, Vijay Endra continues to tell the story. In order to secure the assistance of Guru Pandian, Andrews, and Rajendra Desai, Rocky kills the heir, Virat, and seizes control of the Kalar Gold Fields, KGF. Rocky also kills Kamal when he raises an objection. He gives the go-ahead for eight buried mines to begin production. In the meantime, Athira reappears and massacres every guard stationed at an outpost. Andrews kills Desai to entice Rena outside KGF John then captures Rena as part of a scheme to get Rocky to Athira. While his soldiers are blocking all gold exports from KGF, Athira shoots Rocky but leaves him unharmed. With the help of Inayat Khalil's newly found backing, Shetty teams up with other Andrews subordinates and attacks Rocky's friends along India's western coast. However, Rocky's aides murder Shetty's companions and retake the coast. A recovered Rocky travels to Dubai with Rena to transact business in gold with Khalil and to purchase Kalashnikovs from him. With their freshly obtained weapons, Rocky and his crew murder Athira's henchmen while critically wounding him. A no-confidence resolution against the dis-supported government is prepared by several central ministers who are fed up with KGF. The central ministers want to install Ramaka Sen as prime minister. However, Rocky's goons intimidate other ministers, preventing the motion from passing. In addition, Rocky kills Shetty and conquers Bombay. Guru Pandian cautions Rocky about Sen's ascent to power, but he ignores him. Ramaka Sen becomes Prime Minister of India three years later, in 1981, after winning the general elections. She orders the closure of all state borders. Additionally, she gives CBI investigator Kanagani Raghavan permission to raid Rocky's warehouses after he updates her on the situation in KGF. Rocky's goons catch a young Ingalagi snooping, but Rocky is moved by his moral character. With the exception of a 400-gram gold bar, the CBI investigator finds nothing during their raids. Rocky retrieves the gold bar from a police station. He uses a DSHK to take out the entire building by himself. Later, he suspends all exports from KGF, which strains his relationship with Khalil but allows mining to continue. His assistants track out his drunken biological father, who left his family behind, and pay the unknowing man to take care of his mother's recently relocated grave. Rocky learns about Rena's feelings, and they later get married. He meets with Ramika Sen and offers her a document outlining his role in money laundering, but she refuses to take it into consideration because nearly every member of her party is involved in corruption. Athira, still enraged by his failure, travels to KGF with Andrews, Deya, and John, assisted by Khalil's armada, via a covert passage. He fatally snipes Rena as she tells Rocky that she is pregnant. In the subsequent battle, Rocky kills John and chokes Adhira to death. His army also kill Andrews and Deya. Ramika Sen's address at the parliament is interrupted by Rocky and his goons, who kill Guru Pandian. It is revealed that Athira was falsely accused of orchestrating the attack on Garuda, which Pandian had arranged, and had already told Athira about it. Additionally, it was Guru Pandian who lured Andrews into hiring Rocky, led to the staging of the motion picture about the no-confidence vote in Delhi, and convinced Shetty to work with Khalil in order to win Rocky's trust. Ramika Sen demands that Rocky be executed and uses the Indian army to carry out the death sentence. Rocky escapes KGF with his gold hoard and boards a ship. But before departing, Rocky establishes a new KGF worker colony. He however refuses to give himself up and surrender even after directing the navy to his position. Ramika Sen gives the order to bomb KGF and Rocky's ship, as a result, he drowns in the ocean with the gold, which is still missing today. The youthful Ingalagi resolves to pen a book on Rocky. In the middle of the credits, we are shown that. Three months before Rocky passed away, Ramika Sen receives a file from the CIA detailing Rocky's activities in the US and 16 other countries between 1978 and 1981. The final copy of KGF Chapter 3 is discovered in the present day by a news channel employee. We have reached the end of the movie. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please leave a comment and a thumbs up. Also, hit the bell icon to turn on your notifications. That way you won't miss any of our videos. Thanks and see you next time.